To write the formula for copper to nitrate, we go to the periodic table. We look up copper, which is Cu. We look up nitrate, but we won't find it because it ends in ATE. For nitrate, we need to go to a list of common polyatomic ions. And when we look up nitrate, we see it's NO3 minus. Copper, that's a metal. Nitrate, that's a group of nonmetals. When we have a metal and nonmetals, we have an ionic compound. And we need to think about the charge on the copper and on the nitrate ion here. Copper, it tells us right in the name. We have copper 2, and that Roman numeral 2 means copper has an ionic charge of 2 plus. Then we know the nitrate, that's 1 minus. And these charges, they need to add up to 0 to have a neutral compound. Copper 2 nitrate, that's a neutral compound. So we can change the subscripts to make that happen. We'll use a technique called the crisscross method. We'll move the 1 here and then the 2 out here. Get rid of the charges. And we don't write 1 by convention. Then we need to put parentheses around the nitrate ion. That's because we have two of these nitrate ions. So this is the formula for copper 2 nitrate. But let's check our work. We said copper 2 had a 2 plus charge and the nitrate was 1 minus. Two nitrates, each one's one minus. Two times one minus, that's two minus. One times the two plus, that's two plus. Two plus, two minus, they cancel out. The net charge is zero. So this is the correct formula for copper two nitrate. Let's clean this up. And that's the formula for copper two nitrate. CuNO32. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.